One Owner Car Guy, OneOwnerCarGuy.com. And what I got here for you today is a 1985 Mercedes Benz 250 W123 limo. Someone's here with me today. What's your name again? Lily. Uh, it's Lily, that's right. And the kid's going to be doing the review. We're just going to do a quick walk around to where you can see how it looks. And then we're going to go up close. And the second time, what do we tell them? We should, what do we find? Uh, must have holes in the tire. Find a hole in the tire or anything like that. Any damages, I'll show you that. Come back this way. Perfect. Could you tape it? Tape it? We're taping it right now. Tape the tire? No, you could not tape the tire. And I will bet you, you're not the only person to wonder that. And there's been some awfully old people before that tried something like that. And it ain't gonna work. So that's the car that once around. I'm gonna go now, show you any damages. The car's been off the road for a while. Um, this is the worst tire. You can see it's all split out. And it'll probably go flat while we're doing the video. Yeah. Wheel wells, clean as can be. I'm gonna show you underneath. Underneath, also, clean. I have a lolly in my mouth. She has a lollipop and she took the stick out. She's got this figured out. So that's that. Uh, underneath here, very clean. The little patina like that is all you get. There's no rust through anywhere. And nobody's bashed this around. Very cool, rare piece here. Um, for the American, very shiny, huh? And the Euro bumpers, baby. You don't get these Euro short bumpers on a W123 like this in America. We just don't see them. And these pieces are usually all rotted out. These have usually been bashed around. Absolutely beautiful set of bumpers. Um, and rubbers. That's one of my favorite things on the car. The Mercedes-Benz logo. Okay, you can see the paint is faded. It's just old and it's sat. Clear coat's all gone. You can see where there's clear coat here. And it's it not kind here. Of lost its paint. And it just lost the paint because the clear coat left. Yeah. So that's what you're dealing with. Like Screwy. Like Screwy was losing paint. Her mom had a car and it was doing the same thing. And there'd be spots and everything like this. The good thing about no, this car. We didn't use it anymore. We didn't use it no more. There's no rust. These are tight. No rust around all this. It's tight, 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 tight. And now we do the thing where we look for dings. So down this side, this fender, I got one right here. I found the first one. Eh, a little scratches. But that's where the clear coat is. We're looking for a ding, like that. This door here is actually straight as can be. There's a ding right there. Where? Right there. You're gonna have to look from the side. You can come back here and look right there. You stay right there and I'll show you three of them down here. You'll see what I mean. Very clean right there. Right there, and right, look. Right there, right there, right there. You see them? And that's it, that's all you got for dings. And all this trim, you got a ding in that trim, right there. The lights are in great shape. Going across the back, this bumper is in beautiful shape. I usually find them, but we can't get in the puddle. We can't get in the puddle. He lightly backed into something there, I think, but it doesn't look to have bent the bumper. They can see we got a horny toad out on a hike today. And maybe we'll throw a picture of that in here. I got a picture. So that's the only dings on this side, really. Maybe I missed one. But I'm here to tell you, wheel wells around the openings, everything. Not rusty. Roof, same thing. The paint's faded. You're dealing with faded paint. It's just old, faded paint. This car with a paint job, who, buddy? You got a scratch over there? Let me find it. Yep, a little scratch right there. Trunk lid's pretty clean. Chrome's good. Big scratch, not cool. Big scratch, not cool. Little scratch, okay. And this paint, you're repainting it anyway, so what the heck, all the scratches will be gone. But why don't you go ahead, find them. What are we showing them? Start at the back, we're gonna, where, do you see anything on this panel? Tiny scratches here. You see anything else? Come on. Okay, it's a big one. There's a big scratch. And no dings really. No rust starting at the bottom yet. The tires are just absolutely gone. Um, keep showing. You got it. Little scratches right here. And not really any dings, but it's been chipped up along the edge, like parking lot stuff. You see anything else? Let me know. I see. Bubbles in the bubbles. tent. Bubbles. Tiny bubbles. Little scratchy scratch. This is. I don't know if it's a scratch or a drip down. Um, little scratch here.
faded on this door. Everything's faded. It's just faded. Faded? God, there's just not much. There's a ding right there. It's hard to find a ding. It's a straight car. Somebody really took care of this thing. That's for sure. Okay, so besides that, wheels. Oh, my mom. Okay, so back at you here. I had a phone call. The wheels, you can see what's happening. They've corroded around here. Um, this is actually kind of... But look. Needs to be sanded down, my ground lollipop. down, sandblasted. Okay, we'll show the lollipop. And we'll put a picture of the lizard in here because she wanted to show that. And down below, you can see there's just no rush. You can hear the air leaking out. Um, it's yeah. not going to, it won't last for 10 minutes. Yeah. And look, each tire is split. And it, they all have this on it. So I don't know if you just put some Mexican hat wheels or some um, monoblocks. There you go. Get on the puddle. Monoblocks would be awesome. Sorry I had to swing around the puddle and stuff there. Um, it doesn't have the correct thing here, so it's zip tied up on the muffler. I didn't have the correct O-ring. Actually, I would hear zip zoom kind of. I can go for that. I have lots of them. They're in there somewhere. Can't find them. Okay, so that's your review. That's your car. It's absolutely drop dead gorgeous. And you can see a couple wrinkles in the tinting and stuff, <laughs> stuff like that. Other than that, though, absolutely gorgeous. Ready for your project car needs and all that stuff. Also that, you gotta have the Mercedes logo and this. This is just such a slick piece right there. Okay, so that's the deal. If you're interested, call me up. Nathan, 406-546-8748. www.oneownercarguy.com And it's on Breeder's Collar. It's on Breeder's Collar, too. And what do they do? What do we need them to do? Hit the thumbs up and subscribe down below and then after that there's a bell there's a bell click on it you can click on it so click you the you have to you have to you have to okay cool thanks for watching i'll throw the interior in here in a little while and lily's off she learned how to use an air compressor today it's quite a day i tell you thanks for watching we'll talk to you